obviously I, I didn't know massive amounts about the league until I spoke to the gaffer um, and then when I did I did some a bit of research and had a quick look online and uh, knew it was really up and coming and, um, and and growing every year had to think about it with my family I, I thought it'd be um, you know a great opportunity we knew it was going to be tough obviously with the um, you know the short turnover that we had at the start of the season um, everybody coming together I think we've still got players in quarantine now so um, but um, we knew it was going to be tough and um, you know we're progressing every every day and every game so hopefully now we can uh, start picking up the three points I think you know we I think we've you know three games unbeaten out of the four hopefully we can um, keep that unbeaten run going but turn the draws into win the Premier League's the, the best league in the world everybody will agree I'm sure um, all the best players in the world want to play there and and do play there. Um, you know, every game is really tough. Every player is really good, and um, you, know, you know, it's there's there's only one place everyone wants to play the football, and that's in the Premier League. So, I was lucky in, lucky enough to do that um, for three years, and uh, you know, it was a great experience. Yeah, there's some really good young players coming through. Um, you know, watching the games, there's been some some really good talent. Um, some surprising as well, how young some of the players are that that, that have got. Um, you know, some good talent and hopefully the league will keep progressing and growing and, and you know, the pool of players will. Yeah, it was massive. Obviously, you don't turn uh, Robbie Fowler down when he, when he gives you a phone call and asks him to come and play for, for him. So, yeah, it was a massive opportunity and a uh, different experience. Like you say, I played all my football in England, so it was an opportunity that, um, to go and try something different. The winner against Man United, beating Man United, they went on to, uh, I think they went unbeaten for the rest of that season. So, um, and, and they went on to win the league under Sir Alex Ferguson. So, to, to score the goal that, that, that beat them that year was, you know, a, a, a great part of my career. No, no one wants to play football behind closed doors. It's it's not the same. Um, the passion of the fans, you know, the intensity of the game's not the same. So. Um, you know, hopefully one day very soon that you know the fans can be allowed back in the stadium and we can feel that atmosphere and that energy from from the crowd. And um, football's not the same. Like I say, we miss the fans, and especially this season, I was obviously looking forward to playing in front of the great fan base that we have. And you know, hopefully one day that can happen.